So here is to hoping I don't get rained on on the way home because it smells like rain. It's not wet yet, but the clouds are there and I can I can smell the rain air. Soaked jeans is not fun. So first topic of the day. Tesla. Nope, that's not the first first topic, but that is a Tesla. First topic for the day is favorite TV shows. So the reason I decided to do this topic is because Breaking Bad is getting into the last few episodes ever, and I am the bi biggest Breaking Bad fan. I am the biggest Breaking Bad fan on the face of the planet. Well, I don't know about that. I like to think I am. <laughs> but Breaking Bad has got to be the number one show on TV right now, in my opinion. So if you haven't been watching Breaking Bad, get on Netflix and watch the first five seasons, well, up until the episode we're on right now in the fifth season, in time for the finale, so you can watch the finale in five weeks or so when that airs. There are five episodes left at this point in time. I don't know how many there will be by the time I put upload this. Because I'm just making topics off a of whim and uploading when I feel like it. My lights seem super dim right now for some reason. I need to get some HIDs. HIDs up in this biznitch. Um, so yeah. Breaking Bad has got to be my favorite TV show right now. But I do have a lot of favorite TV shows. Interestingly enough, I don't like, or I haven't until like a few months ago, had a cable plan. I downloaded all my shows. I still do, but I have cable now just because. Um, well, actually, the reason being is because my fiance works from home and she likes to watch the Today Show in the morning, so that is why I have it now. But I don't complain because now I can watch sports easily live on the big screen uh, without having to worry about streaming and whatnot. So, anyways, uh, yeah, so I still have always downloaded a crap load of TV shows and I watch just about all the new shows that come out, at least for the couple new couple episodes, just so I can see if I like it or not. Um, but right now, my favorite TV shows are, well, I've always been a huge Office fan, but The Office isn't returning. Modern Family is probably my second favorite show on TV behind Breaking Bad. Uh, I also watch How I Met Your Mother. Don't ask me why I still watch it. I think it's pretty bad now um, but the first four seasons first three to four seasons I loved um, but it's kind of just like fell off the they, they, I don't even know what they're doing anymore they got problems none of the episodes are really I mean they're funny here and there but they're not funny like they used to be the storyline is kind of shot they are not really uh, pushing it very well or I felt they haven't pushed it very well in the past few seasons I just think it used to be a lot funnier, but I still watch it just because I, I want to find out the story. Um, what else? Survivor is probably behind Breaking Bad, my favorite show on TV. Actually, it could be my favorite show um, because I've watched I've watched uh, Survivor for twenty. What is it? The twenty sixth season now. I think it's going to be twenty seven, maybe. Um, I've watched it since the first season. When I was 10 years old, or uh, yeah, I think I was 10 years old when the first season uh, aired. And I have watched every single season. I am in love with that show. <laughs> um, so that's up there with Breaking Bad uh, as my n number one favorite show. Uh, probably tied, we'll say. Uh, what else do I watch? Uh, I used to watch Amazing Race. I haven't watched that past few seasons, but that used to be a favorite show. Um, I uh, one of another, an obscure show uh, is The Client List. I mean, 
I mean, come on. It's uh, Jennifer Love Hewitt plays a massage therapist in a questionable massage uh, parlor where they basically uh, give peop- give guys happy endings. And the whole premise of the show is uh, her husband left her and she's got to find a way to make money and so she's got a job at this massage place and starts uh, taking on the clients who want happy endings. Uh, so, I mean, Jennifer Love Hewitt, lingerie, uh, I don't see who wouldn't watch it. The story, it's got, I mean, some of it's, it's a, some of it's pretty corny here and there, but, I mean, it's, a, it's an entertaining show. I can't remember what channel it's on, but, uh, that's a good one. Uh, what else? I watch, uh, America's Got Talent. I'm a real big... Uh, what, it, what do you call it? Um, reality show. I love reality shows. So, America's Got Talent. I've been watching that this summer. I've always watched those. Um, trying to think what else. What are the current shows I really want? Oh, Top Gear. I'm a huge Top Gear fan. Seen every single season ever. Um, uh, even before Richard Hammond was on it. I've uh, watched all of those seasons as well, or uh, as the Brits call it, uh, series. Uh, what else? Mythbusters. I watched Mythbusters, although I haven't watched the most recent season. Um, I mean, when you watch as many freaking shows as I watch, there, uh, there's only so much time in the day, especially when you a go to work. Well, I don't know why I'm using letters to use do this list. I think numbers would probably be better. <laughs> ah, one, go to work. Two, work out. Three, make videos. Four, edit and upload videos. Five, comment on all the videos. <laughs> There's only so much time in the day. I don't know if you guys if you guys can see this sky. It looks pretty sweet. As you can see, there's tons of rain clouds all around. Everywhere I look, it's rain clouds. And the people behind me are probably like, why are you going so slow and pointing around? that's enough for on for this list i know there's more i just can't remember them right now um but breaking bad and survivor are my top two um so leave a comment let me know what your favorites are or leave a comment let me know what you want the next topic to be um but in this vlog the other comment topic i've got for you guys is exhaust so i'm replacing my exhaust finally on my R1, um, if you follow me on Facebook or Instagram, you'll see the picture that I posted asking for you guys to give your opinions. Got a crap load of comments on that. Um, but consensus, consensus uh, says shows that most people uh, want me to get the toast exhaust. I'm not saying what everyone's uh, what it comes out to number one amongst all of you guys is going to be what I choose, but because I pretty much had a, what I wanted set uh, to start with. I just wanted to get some more thoughts from people if they have any had anything unique um, or uh, reasons for things. But I'm pretty 100% uh, set on my decision. Well, no, we'll say 99% set on what I want. I don't know why. No one ever yields. Ever. No one ever yields as at that exit. There's almost impossible to get all the way across. Exhaust. Let me know if you got an, opi- uh, an opinion. Leave it in the comments. Uh, but I'm pretty probably 99% set on what I'm gonna get, and this is this is what I have w- been wanting to get. So I can't really say that any 
uh, anything really changed in my mind. But, I mean, you, you guys will find out, so stay tuned for that. Uh, and a little uh, extra thing going on. Uh, I am going to be another probably 95% sure uh, going to be doing a vinyl wrap on my car, Zoe. Uh, going to be doing a 3M 1080 dark matte gray uh, on Zoe. Um, I've already looked at some pictures of uh, another, another E46 M3 that had the same vinyl wrap done and I am in love with it. There's another car that I've seen that has the matte, dark matte gray. Uh, and I am stoked to do it. Uh, and I'm going to be doing it myself. It costs like $2,000, $2,500 to have someone do it for you. But the materials are only like 400 bucks. So I'm going to give it a shot. One of my good friends, he uh, did his own vinyl wrap on his car and it turned out spectacularly. So, I think I can do it. We'll see how it works out. And the best thing about it is if you don't like it, you uh, can take it off. Um, obviously, you're out a few hundred bucks, but I mean, to just keep it a few years uh, and you can switch to something new or go back to how you had it. So, that's, up w that's what's up with that. Let me know your thoughts on that. I'll be doing some pretty sweet wheels with it, but that'll probably come a little farther down the road when I actually have the money for wheels. Uh, but yeah, lots and lots and lots of money spending coming up. Probably not a great idea, but that's what's happening. So be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment about all those random crap things that I told you that I would love your opinion on, because really you guys always leave interesting things in the comments and uh, I enjoy reading them, using them uh, to shape my opinions and uh, we'll see how it goes. So yeah, hit that like button, follow me at Facebook, Twitter, links in the description and I'm out. Oh, I forgot to mention, this is being filmed after the end of this vlog. Past shows I'm in love with that have stopped friends I am one of the biggest friends fans ever thanks to my fiance who got me to watch it a few years back and I watched all 10 seasons in the span of about three weeks and now I pretty much watch it at least every other day so yeah you could probably say I'm a pretty big friends fan just a little bit yeah, yeah, yeah a little bit uh, and then actually after that I haven't really haven't really played it all that much. Um, I mainly used it for Blu-rays, but now I don't even use it for that much anymore. Because uh, I've got a bunch of movies on my computer and I, I actually built my own home theater.